Rice Krispie treats that taste like Snickers bars. Let's see what's cooking. Let's get the facts. Let's see what's cooking. It's time for yo yo max 12. Hello, everyone. The first part of this recipe is basically making a Rice Krispie squares. Five cups of miniature marshmallows, quarter cup of butter. I put mine in the microwave in a large bowl for about a minute to a minute and 30 seconds on high until the marshmallows get all nice and puffy and the butter is melted. Then stir those two things together until smooth and then add in about five and a half cups of Rice Krispie cereal. Stir until well coated and then you're going to place this mixture into a 9 by 13 inch baking dish. You can line it with cooking spray, aluminum foil that's been greased, or in this case, I'm just using baking parchment. Press the Rice Krispies into the bottom until it's nice and even. Then take a 14 ounce bag of caramels, three tablespoons of milk or cream, and you're gonna microwave this on high for 30 second intervals, stirring every 30 seconds or so until the caramels and milk are nice and smooth. Pour it on top of your Rice Krispies. Spread it around evenly. And then take one cup of peanuts. I use salted peanuts and just sprinkle it on top. The whole peanuts are good, but you can use chopped peanuts if you'd like. I just press them gently into the caramel mixture and then let it cool just slightly so that you can touch the caramel without it sticking to your fingers. It doesn't take long. And then I spread two cups of melted chocolate chips on top. I actually used milk chocolate chips this time around. Spread the chocolate around and you're gonna put this in the refrigerator just until the chocolate is set and then take them out and then cut them into squares. And once it's cooled and firmed up, you don't need to store it in the refrigerator, store it at room temperature. Now the picture I saw for these on Pinterest, I think it was, the caramel had actually stayed in a nice layer on top of the Rice Krispies but as you can see with mine, the caramel actually went right into the Rice Krispies and kind of permeated all of the Rice Krispies and didn't make a nice little layer like a Snickers bars would have. But you know what? These were absolutely delicious. Um, I normally bring these to work, but in this case, Max um, forbade me to. And uh, I, they were eaten right here in my house. These are really, really good. They do taste a little like a Snickers bar because of the caramel and chocolate and peanuts. They are a great fast dessert that I think anyone would love. Thanks for watching. Now here's another caramel chocolate inspired bar that is just amazing. Chocolate chip popcorn bars. These are really, really good. If you're looking for something different and absolutely delicious, try these ones. Go ahead and click on your screen. Bye-bye.